Okay, so are you shy and are you scared of rejection? Like you don't, you not you you don't want to talk to nobody or you don't want to approach nobody because you're scared of a rejection. Then keep watching this video. I'm going to show you a trick that I came up with, a secret trick that I came up with. I call it's like a game. I call it a game. It's a trick slash game that I came up with for rejection, so you won't be scared or shy to approach people. All right. I screenshot it because I wrote this down as a comment a long time ago, but I screenshot it. Okay, so look, for the read off the phone, this is what I wrote down. Here is a trick for rejection. Let's call it a game. Say you and your friends go out, or even if you are by yourself, you can still do this. So this is for girls and boys. You go out with some friends, you can do this by yourself, or you can do it with some friends, it don't matter. This works for girls and boys. Men don't matter. Women, men, whatever. Transgender, it don't fucking matter. But let me keep... Okay, say you and your friends go out, or even if you are by yourself, you can still do this. The goal of the game is to get rejected. The goal of the game is to get rejected. Whoever gets rejected the most wins the game. So now you have this goal in your mind to get rejected. So now it's a win-win situation in your mind. If you don't get rejected, then you lose, but not necessarily. If you don't get rejected, that means you got the number, which isn't a real loss. But if you do get rejected, then you win, because that's the whole point of this game. The point is to trick your own mind with this game. So the only way to lose this game is by not getting rejected and getting the girls or boy number. And the only way to win this game is by getting rejected. So if you don't understand what I just said, replay all this stuff I just said. So basically it's a game of trick. The, the goal of this game slash trick is to get rejected the most. And also, while I'm saying this, while I'm in the middle of saying this, this not a part of the game, but this just, this less like, this gonna be, I'm gonna bring this up in the end of the video, but I'm bringing it up now. But this is for the end of the video. When you get, write down all the people that rejected you, they names. I don't know if y'all can see that. These all the girls that rejected me over the past. These all the ones I can remember that rejected me over the past. Few, over the past years, I guess. Two, two, three, two, three years, whatever. These all the girls that rejected me, all right? That's not part of the game. You'll have to do this, but I suggest you doing it. Like, it also helps with rejection when you write down their names. Look, look at all those X's. All, that means they all rejected me. That's not part of the game, but anyway, this is a key, a secret to rejection, all right? So do this game. The goal of the game, again, is to get rejected the most. It's to get rejected the most. So you go to post somebody, and your goal is to get rejected by them. But if you don't get rejected by them, that means you get their number. You get it, you get the game, you want to get rejected the most, and whoever get rejected the most wins. So it's a win-win situation. If you lose the game, you get the number, which is not really a real a loss. But if you win the game, you get rejected, which is the whole point of the game. So you win it either way, if you understand. It's psychology. You tricking. The point is the placebo effect. You trick your own mind into overcoming rejection, and you practice this, practice this. And as a bonus, this is not part of the game, but this as a bonus. Write down the people... Make sure you get their name. When you approach a person that, um, um, how you say, introduce yourself, make sure you get their name, rejected you. Now, one of these girls, no, nah, I ain't gonna say that. That ain't, that ain't important. But anyway, these all the girls that rejected me. As a bonus, write down all the people that rejected you. It's not, nothing bad, nothing negative about them. I don't got nothing to say bad about them. Like, I ain't really tripping over rejection because I overcame it a long time ago. But it ain't nothing bad. But yeah, write down the people that rejected you. Just keep going. That means you actually trying. You can see your progress that you actually trying. You approaching these people. This means you are actually trying. Trying is better than not trying at all. So trying is trying to mean getting rejected, even if it means. But trying is okay. You know what I get. What I'm saying, though, I'm messing up my words. But yeah, this is a game. The secret trick I created for rejection for you people, girls or boys. Don't matter. You can do this. Talk to your crush, whatever. It works. Trust me. This shit works. Okay. So go ahead and try it. Hope you enjoyed this video. Stay tuned. Blah, blah, blah. I'm for the end of the video. Blah, blah, blah. All right. See y'all soon.